Hi, welcome to week 10 of NFNL Picks, the show picking Steelers, Browns, Bills, a dog, and a coin toss. My name is Pat Ritz. Time to pick them. The wrath of Khan continues with Pittsburgh being active at the trade deadline. This week, the three-point road dog Steelers travel to D.C. to face the upstart Commanders. Jaden Daniels is showing he has command of Washington's offense, putting up nearly 30 points a game, while the Rust Belt has the Steeler offense revving things up as well. Pittsburgh's defense is feasting on QBs this year, and Daniels will get a full helping, but the Steelers shouldn't sleep on the Commanders. All time, Washington has the edge, but Steelers are 5-1 in the 21st century. I'm taking Steelers to cover and win. We are from the town with the great football team. We cheer the Pittsburgh Steelers. One hundred and eighty-three feet was the magic number off the foot of Bills kicker Tyler Bass last week. This week, the four and a half point road favorite Buffalo Bills travel west to take on the Indy Colts. For Buffalo, Allen is coming back to less than superhuman numbers, but he definitely outshines Joe Flacco. Possessing the football is an issue for the Colts, who have given the ball away three times more than the Bills with both teams taking it away 15 times. It's hard to get a read on Indy. They don't score much, but keep things close, with all nine games being one possession wins and losses. Don't look now, I'm taking Indy to cover. Bills to win. To the dog, where the five and a half point favorite San Fran Niners head east to take on the Tampa Bay Bucks. These days, Brock and crew are looking pretty ordinary, while the Baker Nears let one slip away on a Monday night against Casey and the Sunshine Boy. Look for Mayfield to get one back. Bucks to cover and win. For the coin toss, it's the one and a half point road favorite Jets traveling west to Arizona. For this pick heads, I get Gotham tails, I get the cards. It's tails, I get the Cardinals. All right, so let's take a look at last week's numbers. I want one and three on wins and oh and four on spreads. What a shit week. Shout out to Tyler Bass for the Buffalo win, but it's still a solid F. Hey, feel free to like, share, subscribe, and comment. We'd love to hear your picks and opinions. Plus, they all help the algorithm reach more people. And as always, remember, keep grinning and picking.